Hello everyone and welcome to the second episode of my new East series and today is all about Hello, the second mini album. So previously I checked out New East in a Discovery episode. I really loved that album and then I last episode with the previous album I was feeling 50 50 with some of the songs um at the moment i made the video for the first episode and then coming into hello things have changed a little bit i growers have become regulars <laughs> on my playlist i go back to that album a lot and i really really enjoy that now so like i said previously I'm very much a moody listener, which is why I never count out an album. I know that I'm the type of person, even if I'm not vibing with something at the moment, one day I wake up and I'm like, you know what, let me go and listen to all the songs that I say that I was not feeling, or oh, let me give this artist another shot and stuff like this, which is why um I think I'm able to really enjoy music because I know that um, my taste is always changing, always evolving, and I love to be surprised. I love to um, realize that an artist actually made me change my mind. I love to realize that my stance on a particular discography have changed over time because all that just tells me that I am engaging more and more with that artist's discography and their music. And it's just another proof that I'm really invested in them. So coming into this album, I had, let's say, middle expectations because I didn't know what was going to happen, if I was still going to feel conflicted with the music, was it the sound of the previous album, or what was going on um, when it came to me and appreciating new music. So I went into this album, I listened to the album, and I was happy from the get-go like from the very first moment the very first song I knew that I was really going to enjoy that album from beginning to end um you know sometimes life is like this you some song you get into them from the get-go others it takes time for you to adjust or just start liking this particular type of music. But when it comes to this album, that was an instant favorite. I've really enjoyed myself with this one. So many, so many good songs. Um, but if I'm talking about favorites, I have three of them in this album that made it onto my playlist, starting with my number three, Hello. Tell me, baby, where you at? Maybe I'll be there wherever you are. I'll be there. Pick up the phone, girl, cause I gotta be there. Now 
나도 알아 내 행동 비겁해 비가 받아 놀려도 난 절대 못가 너는 이런 내맘 말까 너는 내게 가는 길이 내게 왜지 오케이 같이 느껴져야 되는 건지 이거 말이 안돼네 외로움 달래준 건 안돼 어서 말해 제발 아무 사이 아니라고 왜난 안돼 한번 해봐 아무 말이라도 지금 먹고 그서 뭐하니 지금 뭘 멀리서 뭐하니 바라보는 내가 느껴지지 않니 하고픈 말은 다 내래 미안하단 말도 내래 자꾸 어쩔 바 바로 여기가 네가 있어야 할 자리 여보세요 밥은 먹었니 어디서 뭘 하는지 걱정되니까 Don't say goodbye. I just wanna let you know. I only think about you, girl. What would I be without you, girl? What would I be without you, girl? And that was my third favorite in this album. I love it. Ah,、uh, something that is amazing when it comes to um, New East is the vocals. Oh, amazing! <laughs> They have amazing vocals, and they use it so well. And I just love this song because you know the production is 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 nice. It's but the song is very simple. The melody is simple. Like there's not much happening when it comes to the beat and everything. It's really the vocals that are carrying the song, and that's one of my favorite favorite things when it comes to music. Like I love all the other type of music, you know, dance song,、uh, anthems, and all this other type of stuff. But you know, sometimes I really love to take a moment and truly appreciate an artist for the talents. And I feel like simple songs like those are the best way for somebody to showcase. Everything that they have to offer, because your voice is not hiding behind the beat, without、uh, behind all the sweet shops, behind all the different instrumentals going on. You know, it's a very simple melody, and your vocals do everything else. And I really, really enjoy that.、Um, also, I am in the process of、um, really getting to know the members more and. Their voices. So far, I only got like Beko. I I hope that's how you say his name. I only got Beko's voice down, and then I'm still working on the others. But I'm really looking forward to knowing everybody and their voices. Ah,、uh, it's something that I really love when I get to know an artist because it truly tells me that I am invested and interested. So so far, only I only know Beko's voice. I hope、um, that by the next album, I will be able to differentiate everyone and be able to name them. But、um, "Hello" is a very nice song. Now, my second favorite is "Hello Hello." So there's "Hello," it's one song, and then "Hello Hello" is another song. So number two, "Hello Hello." I want your ear, my blue no back. I'm not your only you. You beat me, match up. Oh, my mind match up. Mid the night, I'm going to hit you. Just wait, yo, this is my show. Now I'm looking at you, I'm watching you. Don't play nice, I'm going to go. Yeah.
对抗，面对逆境，太阳照进内脉，就算重要，我得把自己。Was my second favorite in this album. Hello, hello. I enjoy the song. I it's just a happy song, a fun one, and you'll have it on repeat because you know it's just one of those mood lifter type of music, and I really enjoy that. I'm not the biggest fan of dance music and EDM and stuff like this. But when it's done very well, I find myself kind of obsessed with them. So I really love the song, and it's been on repeat ever since I heard it. Now, when it comes to the number one on the album, in my opinion, it is "Beautiful Solo." <laughs>
that my favorite song in this album beautiful solo i love it it's the last song on the album and what a way to end like you really leave this album with your energy to the highest point possible with the biggest smile on your face and that's just what this song is i really love it it's typically not the type of song that i enjoy but they make it work and i really love that um I love this album. Uh, I love getting to know newest, learning the voices, um, finding out more about the type of sound that they like and stuff like this. So this journey has been very nice so far. And I'm really excited for the next chapter because what I'm looking forward to the most is really finding the album. You know, the album that just makes you be like there is no turning back for me i'm in this stuff for life that's what i'm looking for when it comes to new East discography like i want to be rolled um from an album and really be like i don't even know what to choose that's what i'm looking forward to the most um when it comes to this journey like what is going to be the album the one that really uh, makes me go crazy but don't get me wrong this one is a very very good one um i believe it's a it's a very solid project and i enjoyed myself a lot let me know in the comments if we have the same favorite in this album or is yours different what's the best newest album in your opinion what's their best song in your opinion what's your favorite era your who is your bias and all that good stuff that's it for me today and i talk to you very very soon